Hello, I'm going to share with you today a tip for positive communication that you can start using within your everyday. So as part of my teachings and my coachings and my workshops, I help people to identify their um, the positivity that is around them. And this is a daily practice. It's not easy. So what's happening in your mind oftentimes reflects what you see out there. So if you've got some negative self-talk in your mind, then you will be more in tune and aware of some of the negativity that's happening around you. So one of the tips I'd like for you to think about today is how in tune are you with the emotional state of the people around you? Are they more positive? Are they more negative? Or are they neutral? And you can't get a feeling on their emotion. Um, so this really depends on your environment. It depends uh, where you are from day to day. And of course, the people that are around you. Do they drain energy from you or do they provide you with energy? So which one of those do you want to be? Do you want to be the person who provides the energy and sustains people emotional states throughout the day? I would assume, yes, that that's the one you want to be. So for this tip is really just to be aware of other people's emotions around you, how they make you feel, what are your own emotions, and how do people react to them. And I have a, an example to share with you. In fact, I, I sat with somebody that I had coached a few years ago, and um, he was saying, you know, he manages a, a large team, and he was saying, you know, he was observing the emails of one of his direct reports. And as he was read it, like it would be good, good. And then he would read a part of it and he'd cringe. Ooh, I can't believe he said that or wrote that. Um, and so his ear now is being tuned into the negativity that he sees and or hears from the people around him. And he says, ooh, that could have been misunderstood uh, from others, by others. So he's now got the ear um, for, for really being closely in tune with the negativity or the positivity around him. And uh, so that, so now he's coaching others to, to be, um, to use more positive communication. So that's my tip for you today. I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you do apply it and use it, uh, please let me know how it goes. You can email me at all times at sonia at harvestperformance.ca.